did actually say, would you mind if I gave a couple of thousand tomahawks to your opposition? I did. Titan Air presents the missile that can hit any target from 1,000 miles away. The vast ocean stretches endlessly beneath a pale dawn sky. Gentle waves shimmer in silence. Then the metallic hatch of a destroyer slowly opens. Steam hisses. A cylinder rises toward the light. Beneath this calm surface lies one of the most advanced weapons ever created by man. A missile that doesn't just fly. It thinks. A weapon that changed the very nature of war. The Tomahawk cruise missile. Capable of traveling more than a thousand miles to hit its target with surgical precision. It's the weapon that gave the United States the power to strike anywhere at any time without ever setting foot on enemy soil. The story begins in the shadow of the Cold War. A time when two superpowers raced to outsmart each other. The Soviet Union had its nuclear giants. America needed a weapon that could strike deep inside enemy territory, silently, accurately, and without provoking a nuclear response. In 1972, engineers from General Dynamics were given an impossible mission to design a small, low-flying missile that could travel hundreds of miles and hit within a few meters of accuracy. They envisioned a weapon that could slip under radar, follow the curve of the Earth and strike with pinpoint accuracy. They named it Tomahawk, after the Native American throwing axe, symbolizing stealth, precision and deadly purpose. It was not born in haste. It was engineered through patience, the kind of patience that changes military history. The Tomahawk is 20 feet long, weighing nearly 1.3 tons. It's powered by a compact turbofan engine, giving it subsonic speed, about 880 kilometers per hour. That's not fast by missile standards, but it was never designed for speed. It was designed for stealth. It flies low, so low that radar waves pass right over it. Its small radar cross-section and terrain-hugging flight path make it almost invisible. Inside, an intricate guidance system called TURCOM, terrain contour matching, reads the Earth's surface below, comparing it to digital maps stored in memory. Combined with GPS and inertial navigation, it ensures that the Tomahawk never loses its way even in electronic warfare environments. Every river, every hill, every building along its path is part of its memory. It doesn't just fly, it remembers. Unlike ballistic missiles that launch from silos, the Tomahawk launches from ships and submarines anywhere, anytime. It can be fired from a vertical launch system, VLS, on a destroyer or from a torpedo tube deep beneath the sea. Once launched, it climbs, folds out its wings and begins its journey across hundreds of miles. The ship that launches it never has to see the battlefield. The pilot that directs it never leaves his screen. And yet, the target will soon cease to exist. This made Tomahawk a true symbol of modern naval warfare, long reach, low risk and devastating precision. The world watched in awe as hundreds of Tomahawk missiles were launched during the Gulf War. They flew silently through the desert skies, guided by stars and satellites, destroying command centers, radar arrays and air defense systems. It wasn't just power, it was precision. Each hit demonstrated that technology had redefined the battlefield. The age of random bombardment was over. The era of surgical strikes had begun. Over the next three decades, the Tomahawk evolved with every new conflict. Block 2 improved accuracy and range. Block 3 added GPS guidance and better engines. 
Block 4 introduced in-flight retargeting. Commanders could change the target even after launch. Then came Block 5, the newest generation, more efficient, smarter, and adaptable for both land and sea targets. The modern Tomahawk can communicate mid-air, relay live data, and coordinate with satellites for synchronized attacks. It's no longer just a missile. It's part of a global digital network. Flying at only 30 to 50 meters above the ground, it uses radar altimeters and pre-programmed terrain maps. It avoids mountains, slips under radar coverage, and approaches its target unseen. In the final seconds, it rises, scans the terrain, and dives precisely where it needs to. Accuracy? Less than 10 meters. For a missile traveling over 1,600 kilometers, that's the definition of perfection. The Tomahawk's true strength lies in its reach. From the Red Sea, the Mediterranean or the Pacific, it can hit a target across continents. Without air bases, without warning and without risk to human life. In a single night, a fleet can reshape an entire battlefield from hundreds of miles away. Modern Tomahawks use real-time satellite correction target recognition and encrypted communication to ensure accuracy even in jamming conditions. Some versions can loiter over a region transmitting images until given the command to strike. It's more than metal and explosives. It's intelligence with wings. To the modern military, Tomahawk represents control, the ability to hit what matters and nothing more. It's a weapon built not for chaos, but for precision. Its missions have varied from neutralizing terrorist strongholds to disabling enemy airfields, but its reputation has remained the same, silent, smart, and certain. Every great weapon becomes more than just machinery. It becomes a message. The Tomahawk is America's message to the world. We can reach you anywhere, anytime. Yet it also serves as a reminder that precision can prevent escalation, that control can preserve peace. Its very existence deters conflict, a silent balance between strength and restraint. Engineers are already testing advanced successors, stealthier, faster with AI-assisted flight and real-time decision-making. But the Tomahawk remains the foundation a design so efficient that it continues to evolve rather than retire. From analog maps to AI navigation, it survived every generation of warfare. The Tomahawk didn't just change how wars were fought. It changed how wars were decided. It replaced the roar of bombers with the hum of precision. It proved that power doesn't have to shout to be heard. Camera zooms out, the missile fades into the sky, the tomahawk flies quietly, unseen, until the moment history changes forever.